Hi, I'm JC. Welcome to our series videos of Plariscope. In previous videos, we learned how to observe and measure strength in glass products. Today, we'll get to know a new type of Plariscope. This new type of Plariscope is specially designed for plastic bottles and containers. Let's have a look. This new type of Plariscope is made of two parts. On the bottom, there is a polarizer. And on the top, we see the analyzer. Now, I'm holding a PET preform. View it in natural light. It seems flawless. No defect is visible. But don't be cheated by your eyes. Let's put the PET preform on the sample plate. Now, this pretty preform is placed parallel to the polarizing axis. What will we see from the analyzer? Here you can see a clear black fringe in the center of the preform. Then switch the preform slowly until it is about 45 degrees to the polarizing axis. If this is an optimum preform, we are supposed to see regular parallel flow lines on the sides of the preform. Unfortunately, we didn't find them. Optimum preform when viewing under polarized light, we should find a clear black fringe. When the sample is placed parallel to the polarizing axis, and we should find pa regular parallel flow lines on the sides of the preform when it's placed about 45 degrees to the polarizing axis. Not every manufacturer will be so lucky. We received many preform samples from them. Now, let's pick one of them to have a look. Viewing under natural light, this preform is optically clear. No defect is visible. But how about viewing under plain polarized light? Let's put it on the sample plate. Now, this preform is placed parallel to the polarizing axis. You can see there's no black fringe in the center. Then, slowly switch the preform until it's about 45 degrees to the polarizing axis. There's, there is no regular parallel flow lines on the sides. Instead, we can see obvious small depressions. According to analysis of 12 common defects within PET preforms, we can conclude that there is sinking within the preform. Sinking within the preform can be caused by possible five reasons. One reason is insufficient filling of the mold cavity. Another reason is insufficient cooling temperature within the mold. Other three reasons are listed in detail in our data sheet. In the detailed data sheet, other 11 types of common defects within PET preforms and the measures to avoid them will also be provided for your reference. Hope this improving advice will help reducing your production costs and guarding your quality. If you'd like to know more about this PET preform dedicated Plariscope, follow us in Facebook by searching PTC Optical. See you, bye-bye.